Controversial Congress MP Shashi Tharoor now finds headgears worn by tribals in the northeast outlandish and said Naga headgears are hilarious as they are full of feathers. Addressing a seminar in Thiruvananthapuram with the theme Standing Up to Hatred, Violence and Intolerance in Contemporary India, Tharoor trying to put the Indian Prime Minister in the dock for not wearing the Muslim skull cap said, and I quote, Why does our Prime Minister, who wears all sorts of outlandish headgear wherever he goes around the country, refuse to wear a Muslim skull cap? You've seen him in hilarious Naga headdresses, feathers and various kinds of extraordinary outfits. Why does he refuse to wear the green? Why does our Prime Minister, who wears all sorts of outlandish headgear wherever he goes around the country, around the world, why does he always refuse to wear a Muslim skull cap? You see them in hilarious... Yes, this is another top story at this hour. Controversial Congress MP Shashi Tharoor finds headgears worn by tribals in the Northeast outlandish and hilarious. And uh, we'll cut across live to our editor-in-chief, uh, Wazbir Hussain, on this rather bizarre statement made by the Congress a leader. Wazbir, uh, Congress MP Shashi Tharoor finds headgears worn by tribals in the Northeast outlandish and hilarious. Uh, would you like to react to that? Yeah, is he is saying that the Naga headgear is outlandish or... Why does our Prime Minister who wears all sorts of outlandish headgear wherever he goes around the country, around the world. Why does he always refuse to wear a Muslim skull cap? You see him in hilarious sort of naga headdress and feathers, and you've seen him in various kinds of extraordinary. Right, uh, we're being joined uh, live by our editor in chief, Wasbir Hussain. Uh, once again, uh, Congress MP Shashi Tharoor Wasbir uh, finds headgears worn by tribals in the Northeast outlandish and hilarious. If you can react to that. And well, the Naga Ho Ho has slammed the Congress MP statement. And speaking to Northeast Live, editor in chief, Wasbir Hussain, Naga Ho Ho President Chuba Ozukum said Tharoor's comment was hilarious and demanded an apology from the Congress leader over the remark. Yeah, is he is saying that the Naga hate you is outlandish or hilarious, then uh, his statement is also uh, hilarious and uh, uh, ridiculous. If India has to maintain as a secular state, how can he love it uh, others' culture? And this is how, you know, we can read the mindset of the Indian leaders in the mainland, how uh, they discriminate, uh, you know, against the Northeast people. But Mr. Ojukum, uh, you cannot generalize because this is a statement made by Sasi Tharoor, Congress MP. Yeah. yeah, that is why we we totally condemn that statement, and uh, we have to demand for uh, apology from him. How can he love uh, it another culture? Mr. Ochukum, will you ask the Congress leadership in Nagaland to take up the matter and extract an apology from their leader, yeah. Sashi Tharoor? Yeah, yeah, sure, surely, surely we will do that, yeah. Mr. Chubas Ochukum, thank you very much for speaking to Notice Lies. Okay, welcome, welcome. Meanwhile, Nagaland Chief Minister took to Twitter and launched a scathing attack on Shashi Tharoor, demanding an apology and withdrawal of his comment. All right, to get more reaction on the entire story, now we are being joined by our editor-in-chief, Wazbir Hussain. So, Wazbir, what do you have to say on this remark?
Yes, I think this is an absolutely ridiculous statement made by Congress MP Sashi Tharoor. We know that he is into controversies, but this time this is a direct insult, I would say, to the entire 45 million people of the Northeastern region. This also exposes his absolute lack of knowledge about the ethnic uh, uh, communities in the region, their tradition, their culture, and their customs. You cannot just say the Naga headgear is hilarious. The feathers are a very integral part of the custom and tradition of people in Nagaland and Arunachal Pradesh. You cannot just insult a community like that. So this is something which is absolutely unacceptable. And we have been talking there is absolute outrage in the region because of this statement. And well, Vazvir, as we can see, sharp reactions are coming in from the region. So your take on this? Yes, there is absolute outrage, as I have said, in the entire northeastern region, particularly in Nagaland, because he has denigrated the Naga headgear. He said that it is hilarious because of the feathers. He said that the tribals in the northeastern region were outlandish. That is the word he used. And we have already got reactions from the Nagaland chief minister, who has been absolutely furious. In fact, you have just heard the Naga Hoho president, Mr. Chuba Ozuko. He has said that the Congress MP has to uh, uh, apologize and he said that Nagaland Congress also has a responsibility to take up the matter and actually get an apology from Sasi Tharoor. And in fact, uh, you know, Fahad and Puja, I would also like to say that Congress President Rahul Gandhi also has a responsibility towards the Northeastern region. Lip service is just not enough. He should rein in people like Shashi Tharoor and teach them some fine sensibilities, not to speak about out of turn, unnecessary comparisons. Prime Minister not wearing a skull cap is something absolutely irrelevant in this whole issue of comparing Naga head and headgears worn by people in the northeast. Right, thank you, Wasbir, for all that details. Uh, that was Wasbir Hussain giving his reactions on the entire story, which we are tracking at this point in time. A controversial Congress MP Shashi Tharoor now finds headgears worn by tribals in the northeast outlandish and said Naga headgears are hilarious as they are full of feathers.